CIA scholars welcome you all today we are going to start with the new topic so let's see the topic first story sums page number 92 so students we are going to start with the new topic that is story sums so let's see the first question Raghav bought sixty six red balloons and thirty four blue balloons to decorate his house for his birthday party. How many balloons did he buy in all? Now, he has sixty six red balloons and thirty four blue balloons. Okay, so we have to find out how many balloons he has bought in all. Now, your word is all. all means together together so we have to add it that means we have to total it so let us do that 100 tens ones now he has 66 red balloons so write 6 in tens column and 6 in ones column it becomes 66 The next is thirty-four, so three in tens column and four in ones column. Now here the word is all. That means we have to use the sign of plus. Now let us start with the ones column. Six plus four. Now six in your mind, four on your fingers. After six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, so six plus four, you get the answer ten. So zero in ones column, and one in tens column. That's your carryover. Now in tens column, one plus six, one in your mind, six on your fingers. After one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? So one plus six, you get seven. Now seven in your mind, three on your fingers. After seven, eight, nine, ten. So write zero in tens column and one in hundreds column. Okay. Now in hundreds column, here it is one, right? So here there is no number to add. Along with one, so we will write the same number in the answer that is one. So sixty-six plus thirty-four, you get the answer hundred. Now let's move to the next slide. Okay, Sophia and her twin sister bought one hundred and thirty-eight candies to distribute to their friends. On their birthday, they distributed one hundred and fifteen candies. How many candies are left with them? Okay, so Sophia and her sister, that is her twin sister, has one hundred and thirty-eight candies, but they have distributed already one hundred and fifteen. So how many are left? If you see here, the word "left" means Minus. So let us do the sum. Hundred tens ones. So one in hundreds column, three in tens column, eight in ones column. Here it is one hundred and fifteen. So one in hundreds column, one in tens column, five in ones column. It becomes one hundred and fifteen. we will use the sign of minus okay let's start with the ones column 8 minus 5 open your eight fingers and now close your five fingers see how many fingers are open 1 2 3 eight minus 5 you get the answer 3 now we have completed ones column 
we will move to the tens column. 3 minus 1. Open your 3 fingers. Close your 1 finger. How many fingers are opened? 2, right? So 3 minus 1, you get the answer 2. Now we have completed 1s, 10s and now we will do the 100. 1 minus 1. So open your 1 finger and we have to close how many finger? 1, right? So if we subtract the same number, then you get the answer 0. So 1 minus 1, you get the answer 0. So how many candies are left with them? 23. 23 candies are left with them. Now let us move to the next slide. Okay. Simi bought a book for Rs. 145 and a bag for Rs. 350. How much money did she spend in all? Now students, look here. This is the sign of rupees. Can you see this sign? This is the sign of rupees. Okay, so Simi bought a book for 145 and a bag for rupees 350. So how much she has spent in all? All means plus, right? So we have to add both the number and we have to see how much money she has spent. So let us do it. 100 tens once. So the first number is rupees 145. So 1 in hundreds column, 4 in tens column, 5 in ones column. Then it is rupees 350. So 3 in hundreds column, 5 in tens column, and 0 in ones column. We will use the sign of plus. Let us start with 1's column. 5 plus 0. So 5 plus 0, you will get the same answer, right? You are adding the number with 0. So whenever you add a number with 0, you will get the same answer. So 5 plus 0, you get the answer 5. Now we will move to the tens column 4 plus 5 so 4 plus 5 4 in your mind 5 on your fingers after 4 5 6 7 8 9 so 4 plus 5 you get the answer 9 now we will move to the hundreds column 1 plus 3. So 1 in your mind, 3 on your fingers. After 1, 2, 3, 4. 1 in your mind, 3 on your fingers. So 2, 3, 4. So 1 plus 3, you get the answer 4, right? So she has spent rupees 495 so she has spent is 495 so students we have done here three questions so that's all for today thank you